As with all pioneers, he never thought there was a challenge he couldn't surpass. Peter Blake led a successful challenge for the greatest sailing prize of all, the America's Cup. And now he achieved everything he'd wanted on the water. But he was hoping to bring a whole new audience into the Amazon. I had a meeting to get a big school running in Manaus to try and get people to understand about sustainability, about understand the environment, how it affects us, every one of us. Peter was very front up about the security risks. He was aware that this was not going to be a gentle ride, and sadly, he paid with his life. Tonight on One News, he was killed defending his boat and crew against river pirates. Mass gunmen stormed the yacht. Sir Peter went for the rifle in his cabin. After a scuffle and exchange of gunfire, Peter Blake lay dead. After his murder, I wanted to go on a personal odyssey to understand why this murder happened. I wanted to know if there was any truth to the rumors that Peter had been targeted for his environmental work. I spoke to a lot of people. I read all the stories. Where else in the world would you have logging companies having armed guards? There's two possible stories here. One is that it was just simply a robbery. The other one is that there were people further up the food chain pulling strings. And for Peter Blake, can't rule it out. This documentary had turned into a murder story. It would start with the hunt for the pirates. Ricardo Tavares, charged as the man who fired the shots that killed Sir Peter. You can run away, but you can't hide from the damage you've done. The Amazon is the most deadly region in the world for environmental activists. He grabbed me behind my throat. It was with the knife. The number was up, mate. Now that we've got a president with this violent discourse, it's almost a guarantee that we'll see more bloodshed. I think there's a greater truth to come out about why Sir Peter was murdered. Who was the mind behind the crime? Whose idea was this? You know what? His light doesn't dim. It doesn't dim in the passing of time.